Hello everybody and welcome back to the BND Bricks channel. I'm sorry it's been so long since I last uploaded. If you saw my community post the other day, you'll know why. But if you haven't, then the short explanation is I just haven't had much motivation. But what you're looking at right now is some of the sets that I've had displayed for a while, but this one's new. Now, you may be wondering, why have I not reviewed this set yet? I have in fact had it since Christmas. Well, that's what I'm going to get to in this video. But the reason I'm making this video is to let you guys know that there are going to be some changes coming to my channel just going forward with the future so that it's easier for me to manage. And right now what you're looking at is my clone army, which is one thing that will be changing a lot. So let's get into this video. So the first thing I wanted to talk about is why I'm not going to be doing too many more set reviews just going forward. What you're looking at right now is my Back to the Future DeLorean, which is new, and my Medieval Blacksmith, which I built on live stream a few weeks ago. So reviews are just not fun for me to do anymore. I was making them over the summer initially because it was an easy way for me to make a bunch of content all at once and then not have to worry about really thinking too much about it. But it's really not something that I enjoy very much and it's just something I don't really want to keep doing going forward. Obviously, whenever I get a really cool new set, and I will do reviews for all of these sets that I got eventually, but I just really have no motivation to do them anymore. I don't really also have a place to do them, which is part of the struggle. The second change that will be coming is the amount of live streams I'm doing. Live streams are something that I really, really enjoy, and I'd like to be doing more of them. So those will probably be coming more often, probably on a monthly basis. And I will be streaming here on YouTube, so you don't need to worry about going anywhere else. But that's just something I really have enjoyed, and I would like to continue doing that going forward. As far as what I will be doing on those live streams, well, right now you can see, that's actually a mock that I started, but... You can see um, all these unsorted Legos, especially down here. This is mostly Hero Factory stuff. But one thing I'll probably be doing is sorting through my Legos, like, just so I can actually start like really building mocks, which is, again, the second thing that I would be doing on live streams. So that's something I'd like to start doing, and I hope that you guys would want to see that. So it really just be like a chatting live stream, but I'm also sorting Legos. The next big change that will be coming is the types of content that I'll have on my channel. So obviously I said that there's going to be less reviews, but one of, one of the things I would really like to be doing is more mock building. I've actually been building more mocks recently. I made a custom Lego Kratos, and I built a mock for that. It's a very tiny one. And then I've got all my Spartan soldiers I'd like to do something with. I started, like you saw in the last thing, a mock based on the video game Super Liminal, which I had a video plan for, and then I just I, I couldn't find any of my pieces that I needed. So it's a little bit of a struggle. But that's one of the other big changes that will be coming. And then a second change that will be coming is that my clone army, which is obviously massive. So basically picture it like this, but without any of those, any of those, and like two of those. Essentially, I'm probably going to be getting rid of all of my phase one clones just because I don't really like them. I got them all for really cheap when I was really into the buying of the clones just to have them, but I really don't want them. They don't add anything to my army. I'd much rather just decal like shock troopers and have those all be shock troopers instead of bomb squad troopers or even just phase two bomb squad troopers because i just think that they look a lot better in my opinion and that's what i would rather have so i mean yeah that's where i'm at right now but those are all the main changes i am again really really sorry that i haven't been able to upload so much recently i've been focusing on other aspects of my life and i just kind of lost track of the whole lego youtube thing if you've been looking at my community post you'll see that i've had some stuff there just to have some stuff there at all but it's really been a struggle for me to get stuff out. So I hope you guys can tolerate my horrible schedule and I'll be trying to help you guys get more stuff out more quickly. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video.